You are acting so much like your father. Do not compare me to my father. I didn't compare you. I said, I said you're acting like him. You're exactly like your mother. Everything you complain about her, you're doing. You're smothering Henry. First of all, I loved my mother. She was a wonderful mother. I'm just repeating what you told me. Secondly, how dare you compare my mothering to my mother? I may be like my father, but I am not like my mother. You are. You're also like my father. You're also like my mother. You're all the bad things about all of these people, but mostly your mother. When we would lie in bed together, I'd look at you and see her and just feel so gross. I felt repulsed when you touched me. Mm. You're a slob. I made all the beds, closed all the cabinets, looked after you like you were an infant. The thought of having sex with you makes me, makes me want to peel my skin off. You'll never be happy. In LA or anywhere. Now you'll think that you found some better opposite guy than me and in a few years you rebel against him. Because you need to have your voice. But you don't want a voice, you just want to fucking complain about not having a voice. I think about being married to you. To you, and that woman is a stranger to me. You've regressed. You've gone back to your life before you met me, it's pathetic. People used to tell me that you were too selfish to be a great artist. And I used to defend you, but they're absolutely right! All your best acting is behind you. You're back to being a hack. You gaslighted me. You're a fucking villain. Oh, you want to present yourself as a victim because it's a good legal strategy? Then fine. But you and I both know that you chose this life. You wanted it until you didn't. You only used me so you could get out of LA. I didn't use you. You did. And then you blamed me for it. You always made me aware of what I was doing wrong. How I was falling short. Life with you was joyless. What? So you had to go and... Fuck someone else? How could you? You shouldn't be upset that I fucked her. You should be upset that I had a laugh with her. What? Do you love her? No! But she didn't hate me. You hated me! You hated me! You fucked someone we worked with. You stopped having sex with me in the past year. I never cheated on you. That was cheating on me. But there's so much that I could have done. I was a director in my 20s who came from nothing and suddenly I'm on the fucking cover of Time Out New York. I was hot shit and I wanted to fuck everybody and I didn't. And I loved you and I didn't want to lose you either. But I'm in my twenties and I didn't want to lose that and I kind of did. And you wanted so much so fast that I didn't even want to get married. You fuck it, there is so much I didn't do. Well, thanks for that. You're welcome. You are welcome. I can't believe I have to know you forever! Oh. Fucking insane! And you're fucking winning! Are you kidding me? I wanted to be married. I already lost. You didn't love me. Not as much as I loved you. What does that have to do with LA? What? You are so merged with your own selfishness that you don't even recognize it as selfishness anymore. You are such a dick. Every day I'd wake up and I'd wish that you were dead. Dead like, like if I could guarantee that Henry would be okay. I'd hope that you'd get in a car crash and then get an illness and then die. 